Welcome back to my channel. In this video, we will learn about non-inverting amplifier. It is a non-inverting amplifier. So, the input is applied at the non-inverting terminal of the operational amplifier. And the inverting terminal of the operational amplifier is grounded through the resistor R1. It is a negative feedback amplifier. So, the output is fed back to the inverting terminal of the operational amplifier through the resistor RF. Here R1 is the input resistance which is connected to the inverting terminal of the operational amplifier. RF is the feedback resistor through which your output is fed back to the inverting terminal of the operational amplifier. So next let us derive the output expression for this non-inverting amplifier. Uh, you can redraw this circuit like this. There is a feedback resistor which is connected to the output terminal your output terminal your feedback resistor is connected and the other end of the feedback resistor is connected to the resistor r1 so it is connected to the resistor r1 the other end of the r1 is connected to ground so the other end of resistor r1 is connected to ground and the node a uh, where this rf and r1 is connected is connected to the inverting terminal of the operational amplifier here also the node in which this two resistance are connected is connected to the inverting terminal of the operational amplifier so you can redraw this circuit like this here this potential is ba you can uh, get this ba by applying voltage division rule here so ba is equal to total voltage is v naught and here VA is the drop across the resistor R1. So, VA is equal to V0 multiplied by R1 divided by total resistance that is R1 plus RF. So, you get the expression VA is equal to V0 R1 divided by R1 plus RF. And by virtual short concept, this potential is equal to potential at this point. Here the potential is Vi, so simply Va is equal to Vi. If you are replacing Va by Vi, you get Vi is equal to V0 R1 divided by R1 plus Rf. So from this you can write the V0 expression, V0 is equal to R1 plus Rf divided by R1 multiplied with Vi. If you are simplifying this, you get V0 is equal to R1 R1 getting cancelled and second term is Rf by R1. So you get 1 plus Rf by R1 Vi. So your output is 1 plus Rf by R1 times Vi. Vi is the input voltage. And the gain output by input that is equal to 1 plus Rf by R1. So in this output expression, there is no negative sign. It implies that the output voltage is in phase with the input voltage. There is no phase difference between input and output voltage. So, in non-inverting amplifier, the output is 1 plus Rf by R1 times Vi and the gain is 1 plus Rf by R1. This is one method to derive the output expression. Another method is simply by applying KCL at this node. Let us see that. Apply KCL at this node. KCL, Kirchhoff current law. So, at any node, entering current equal to leaving current. Here, in this node, Ending current is IF and the leaving current is I1. And uh, here the current is 0 because the uh, input resistance of the operational amplifier is very high. So, it draws no current. So, in this path, the current value is 0. So, entering current is equal to leaving current. Then you get I1 is equal to IF. Then I1, I1 can also return as voltage divided by resistance value. I1 is the current through the resistor R1. Here the potential is VA. Here it is ground potential. So VA minus 0 divided by R1. And for IF, here potential is V0 and here potential is VA. So V0 minus VA divided by RF. Right? So next, by virtual short concept, here the potential is VA which is equal to the potential at this point and here this point is at VI. 
so your VA is equal to VI. So just replace VA by VI. VI by R1 is equal to V0 minus VI by RF. Then rearrange this equation. Then you get V0 by RF is equal to 1 by R1 plus 1 by RF VI. Then V0 is equal to RF into 1 by R1 plus 1 by RF VI. Then if you are simplifying this, first term becomes RF by R1. Second term is RF by R1 which, which is getting cancelled. So you get 1 here. So V0 is equal to 1 plus RF by R1 into VI. So V0 is 1 plus RF by R1 times VI. And again, that is output by input is equal to 1 plus RF by R1. 